This is Jeff from the Overwatch team. And this is us from the IGN team. We play Overwatch together every day. We got Jeff to critique one of our Overwatch matches and Jeff did not hold back. Oh, this is epic. Oh my God, that was amazing. So I'm Jeff from the Overwatch team. I am excited to do an analysis of this match. I think starting off, uh, well, let's roll the tape and let's see what we've got here. I think uh, team composition, I'm gonna pause it again because team composition is sort of the key. And looking at, knowing that we're on Eichenwald on attack and looking at the exactly. team comp, <laughs> there are some things that I'm very excited about. Like, I think the Farah is a great pick. This yes. can help us get over that Thank choke. You. We can even get around the back and do some distraction. We can fly over that building there. You know, <laughs> you know yeah, you don't Jeff actually knows. do that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> actually, swap That's what diva. you should be doing. <laughs> swap the diva. He's living in his imagination. Yeah. Vinyata is an amazing support. I think Discord Orb is just going to melt the enemy team. But I'm worried here. We only have one tank and only one support. And not that that's not viable, but that means that those uh, DPS and defense heroes, they better be out killing for what the, the tank and the support need to make up for. So let's, let's see how they do. The Timmy spray is... Yes. Uh, spray the boys! Oh, get the boys. Get the boys. Get the boys down! He knows a pro strat when he sees one. Oh, and it looks like the whole team has the Timmy spray locked and loaded. So this is obviously like a pro level group we've got here. You know, not just your average slackers, but a really high, highly coordinated bunch that we're looking at. Now 76 is doing a good job here, even though his team all got picked off, um, he's still working at, at building up ult as much as possible. Um, and of course Zenyatta being responsible as ever, uh, staying there. They're a little overcommitted, um, and they've got the counter pick in that McCree. Uh, Mage just saving herself at this point. Oh, he calls you <laughs> selfish. <laughs> selfish Mage. He's an ice wolf just to save yourself. Survival of the fittest. We're gonna call this the Lord of the Flies comp at this point. Oh, but 76 is there. See, the, the good news is, it might seem like some chaos is going on, but they all have the discipline to get to the point. I love this Arissa route, the Arissa flanking route. And that D.Va just hand handled steadily right there. Shield down, leave it. Now we have, see Zen's ult is up. And this is the test between a great Zen and a quick play Zen is does Zen use that ult to carry the whole team in, or does Zen use that ult to save himself? And only time is gonna tell. Okay, this is good. She's a, uh, that was a good pick. Take out Farah. Getting up and over, I love that shortcut. The problem is that McCree is pretty good on the other team, and it's really tough to play Farah when you've got a really good McCree like that. Now, that was interesting. Let's, I'm gonna go back. I hate that this is well, the one well, bit he well, rewinds. Well. I hate this What's so What's happening in here? Now, let's analyze this. So this is a, a, a high level skilled move you're about to see. It's called fortify yourself and then shoot into the Genji. It's a new character, <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> to make sure that the fortified wasn't wasted. So I want you guys to watch this one right here. Fortify, there's Genji, and look at that. Think of all the damage that Arisa just reduced right there by using Fortify at that time. Uh, it was, it's very subtle and nuanced, but you've got to appreciate some of that. This guy doesn't know his own game. That's why I'm, I'm calling it. He's broken. He doesn't get it. Nerf Jack. Nerf Jack. <laughs> okay, now the other team's bringing Farah. Uh, Zen again is being super responsible. He's got his Discord on the right target there. Very responsible. That's right. Very yeah, someone has to be responsible. Oh, it's, it's weird that the guy editing the video gets all the plaudits. I mean, the footage is right there, mate. Yeah, it speaks for itself. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, don't let Jeff turn us against each other. <laughs> Everyone just turned on me. <laughs> um, Zen just needs his team backing him up a little bit more. Uh, 76 super close to that ult. I'm not sure. See, I'm not sure I would have used it point blank on D.Va. 
he was doing fine hitting D.Va to begin with. Um, luckily, the D.Va didn't use defense matrix against him. Uh, I think the team is going to take it right here. Now, who took Farah? Who's doing that damage to Farah? Is that our McCree again? The enemy team using the uh, discorded Widowmaker charging the point strat. And there's Arisa with Fortify again. Let's let's go back and look at. Oh, that. stop it! <laughs> <laughs> Leave it out, Jeff. Come on, he's had enough. Just I'm just gonna study the Arisa Fortify use. Um, so I think, like I call this strategy the press the button when the cooldown is up strategy. Um, there it is, the Fortify. But maybe what it is is our Arisa players uh, can see into the future. And no, see, she knew that, that that Genji was approaching, and it was very safe and preventative. Now I notice our Arisa's getting shot there and didn't use Fortify, so now I'm, I'm kind of mystified. Um, I'm wondering, it makes me want to go look at the tooltip and see how we wrote it, because maybe we described the ability wrong somehow. Uh, this is one of the toughest parts for a team to get through. Um, so I'm really excited to see how our group does here. Um, now if you notice that enemy team was using uh, Fortify when the Junkrat was shooting his concussive mine. <laughs> you, <Jeff. laughs> that's how you should be. Right? And that's why it didn't knock that Orisa back. But that Orisa was very low on health. Okay, this McCree is wrecking us here. Really good McCree player. Keep going. Try to keep the dream alive. He really <laughs> likes the other team a lot more than us. <laughs> yeah. Ultimate usage really defines great teams from good teams. And um, I'm happy to see that May is sort of saving that ult for the right time. I noticed Junkrat has this his ult too. This. We could get some pretty amazing hey, ult um, combos here. Doesn't so mention it. Really doesn't care. <laughs> Yeah. Slacking off Joe again. <laughs> Stupid slacking off Joe to watch that. So, yeah. Now, May is somebody who can push that cart by herself because uh, she has, you know, her, her cryostasis she, she can go into and she gets in trouble. She can use that wall to block herself. Um, I do like the D.Va change. Good change. Nice. Thank you. Especially in this part of the map, I think using D.Va to get around, to get that additional mobility was a great choice. Um, I also think using the D.Va to harass Pharah like she was doing was really good. So I think that was a, a great pick. And notice it's Zenyatta here, our, our MVP. Zenyatta's like the oh, adult oh, with the five. His words, not mine. He's, uh, he's here. You incepted it. <laughs> <laughs> he's here making sure everybody's doing what they're supposed to, supposed to do. So May's, May's got to be careful. She doesn't want to use... I, I'll take that for the Zenyatta ult. We're, we're in the time where uh, we need it. Now, May was smart not to use her ult and have it get eaten by that defense matrix. That's a worse feeling. Save that for later. That <laughs> <laughs> That's all right, is it? <laughs> um, let's just get this point. I'm sensing an epic end here. Like, we had a little bit of a rough start, but I think uh, some of the hero switching was, was good. I think um, that D.Va change was, was really awesome. We have two tanks now. This Widowmaker, um, I think that's, uh, that was a little suicidal, whatever she was trying there. You're not gonna shoot through that, that Ar Arisa barrier. Oh, good use of the May ult. How many did she get? And drop Diva on it. Here we go. Oh, this is epic. Oh my god, that was amazing. With the bad manners. With the bad manners, he noticed that. I feel a little bad about the spray. I, I thought Zenyatta was... Oh, May wall to save herself, granted, only. <laughs> Cutting you off again. <laughs> May saving herself again. <laughs> Not the rest of the team, but they win. That, that was pretty epic. Now, Zenyatta was rolling in. Zenyatta, hold on, we gotta pause before play of the game. Zenyatta was rolling in as, as the MVP here. He was responsible, he was using Discord. Yeah, yeah. He saved his ult to get the point at the right time. Humble. <laughs> but that D.Va switch into the D.Va ult with the main combo. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. It's really, we did all right. Let's see, this, this better be play of the game. If this is not play of the game, um, somebody in Irvine's getting fired. Oh, come on. <laughs> come 
Come on! Yet another Genji play of the game. We just need to make it so Genji can't get play of the game anymore. It's Where's the D.Va ult? The game winner. Robbed. I was robbed, Jeff. This was just Genji bad manner behind the lines. All in all, I think it was a great match. I think everybody did well. The team rallied. They got through the hardest part of the map together. Good hero switching. Um, An amazing coordination just to roll the end. And that end part is um, that that last corner is where a lot of teams get stuck stuck on. So. Great match. Hey, well done. Hey. Well done. Hey. Well done. Hey. Well done. Hey. Well done. Hey.